Hey guys, what's going on? My name is uh, Coco Does Not Pop, and uh, this is the Town of Light. This game uh, recently came out on Steam, like twenty sixth of February, I think. Um, so a few days ago is the time of this recording, but this is going to be uploaded Tuesday, so almost a week ago. I'm just going to take a quick scan through the options here, real quick, so I can see what I'm dealing with. Okay, there's chapters. Let's just go ahead and start. The Town of Light is based on real facts and places as well as a long documentation concerning mental illness and the life of patients in lunatic asylums from the beginning of the 20th century until their closure. It contains stories which may be disturbing uh, and we advise its use exclusively, exclusively by a public of adults. Uh, the characters and names are imaginary and any reference to people who may have really existed is entirely casual. Uh, this game uses an artistic interpretation of a former Italian psychiatric institution for dramatic purposes. Please note that mental health services have radically improved. If you think you may have psychological problems, please refer to a specialist. So this game's raising awareness to um, mental illness. So that's pretty, it's pretty up there in the be careful what you say list for me. So I don't really What's happened? What kind of place is this? Maybe I'm dead. I can't see any light. I might be dead. I can't get up. What's going on here? What's happening to me? There's no one here. Yet, these noises... God, my head is killing me. I can't keep my eyes open. She must have been drugged. Reality fades away and my skin has gone. Every breath of wind is excruciatingly painful. Excruciatingly painful. I know words. <laughs> That's loading like a motherfucker. What the hell? 1%. What? What could you... What? But what could... Oh. I'm waiting. Don't worry about me. I'm, I'm alright. Today's a big day for recording for me, by the way. I'm recording six videos to go on for two weeks. This is the first I'm recording today. So for the next two weeks, every video you'll see me wearing this outfit. <laughs> just in case you're wondering. Inspired by real facts and events. Names have just changed. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Whoa. Oh my god, this game's beautiful. I've seen the screenshots and the trailers that it released on Steam. It's pretty crazy looking, you know? Some lag, unfortunately. A lot of lag, unfortunately. Must just be because I'm recording. Why did it give me that now? <laughs> this must be the institution then. Well, what was that? Oh, I can sit down if I want to. That's nice. That's very nice. All right, let's see if we can open this door here. Like a boss. Yes. Okay. I have a flashlight, okay. Apparently this game has some puzzles in it. I have another game that I have yet to record on my PlayStation, Ether 1, which is a puzzle game. Game connection. Excellence and story and storytelling. That's an actual reward they put in the game. That's awesome. Sorry. Another one? Accents and story and storytelling. I got two of them. That's odd. Two way speaker. So you can actually like have like be one with the environment and look up pretty much everything. That's kind of cool. Don't think I'm supposed to have anything in here though. I seen a gate over here. I'm gonna see if I can actually go over there. 
Mother! God damn it, I forgot to set a timer out of all the things. Before I started recording for ages, I was like, remember to set a timer. Remember to set a timer. I'll be right back. Timer's going. I apologize. I can't sprint, but I do walk pretty fast. Okay. This is very eerie or something. Even though it is really beautiful. Oh. Okay. The town of light. thing fell. That's very loud music. <laughs> My ears won't be in editing now. That's convenient. Thank you for falling. It's almost like the game wants me to progress. Place. Time. Memory. Synopsis menu. <sighs> she said memory. No memories. Experiences. What has happened? What kind of place is this? Maybe I'm dead. I can see. I can't see any light. I might be dead. I can't get up. What's going on here? What's happening to me? There's no one here yet. There's noises. God, my head's killing me. I can't keep my eyes open. This place. Time. Memory. Medical records. No documents. What was that? There was more stuff down here. Oh, I don't know what any of that means yet. No, I'm sure this is one. Of of those games that's like you have to explore the little things. So I'm just gonna very quickly scan over here in case I see something that maybe gives me a little more light on the situation here because I don't know what's going on. Who's down there? Mess with my crops. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, daisies. So cute. There's a door over here, isn't there? You see, what the fuck? There's a door over there and there's a door here. I'm going through the main one, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Thank God I'm playing this in the daytime. You can't even see, right, the background, but it is daytime outside. The window's actually open. There's light coming in, just the camera's not picking it up, and I think I love that feel. There's no power. The master switch is near the calm, the calm woman ward. Calm woman ward. Oh. That's lovely. What is this? Inventory of patient's personal effects at moments of admission. Oh, sorry. Who are you? Oh, this is Italian. Well, that's my name, isn't it? There's money. This is trash to shit. Library. Didn't think so. I wish there was more, like, you know, atmospheric noises because that's actually less scary for me. The atmosphere noises is less scary than just complete fucking silence. Medkit. I'm actually getting some chills here. I don't know why. Just down my right side, my leg has got a few chills because I'm. The only thing I remember clearly is Charlotte, my doll. Okay. Okay. So, let's look. There's a fucking doll. God, shithole. Not doing too good at the minute, guys. I'm gonna be honest with you. I need power, right? Calm woman ward. I'm looking for signs, but I can't see anything about a calm woman ward. See calm woman ward there, guys? Anyone? It's all in Italian. Oh, waiting room stairs, conference room, calm woman. There's no calm woman ward. 
Is it in a different building? I'm here. So there's stairs into the room next to me, but I can go on ahead down the corridor, and there's a lovely little garden down here. See that? There's the stairs. I'll go there later. Fuck this place, man. Oh my god, no. I'm going out here. Fuck you. Fucking bollocks. Oops. The master switch. Right. I guess I'm going up those uh, stairs. Oh, what's this? I didn't even see that. Thank God I've seen it. Let's take a quick look. Whoa. Ha! Class. Alright, I'm gonna close you. I think that should be the power on now, guys. I'll see here now. Yep. I can walk in front of it and it doesn't do anything. Is this the place I'm in? There's people on the roof there. Wow. This place is very immersive. Let me tell you. That was fun slideshow. Can I go down here? It is not forbidden. Let's find Charlotte. Oh, we have to find the doll. Okay. Whatever you want, protagonist. I played Layers of Fear lately at a friend's house, Anime Killer Gaming. There's a few videos already up there. You can check it out. Uh, link in the description. But, um, it had a lift like that in it. And that experience there doesn't make me want to go in that lift, so I'm going to go over here real quick. No, no, she's freezing. She's alone. Let's look for her. Fuck's sake, woman. <laughs> Let's search the wards on the first floor. There's a plan on the wall which shows where the various wards are located. Okay, let's go upstairs then. Fuck the lift. So we're looking for a doll. This is the first floor. Nice art. It's actually kind of cool. Alright. Um, stairs. Uh, surgeries. Operating theater. Big words. Radiology. Um, a clinic. 10 is nothing. Doesn't even say what it is. Nurse's room. Patient's storeroom and archive. Number 12. On down this corridor over here. I think it might be there, right? Let's just take a quick scan through these rooms. You never know what we'll see. Like that. What the hell is this? Fuck. Damn it, Sophie. Messaging me. <laughs> make my phone beep, make me scared. Okay, okay, put my phone on silent. Whoa. Okay. Renee does not want to abandon her. Are you speaking in third person? Oh, there's the doll. Mummy Whoa. took good care of Charlotte. She tucked her in, hugged her, gave her cuddles and kisses. She was very affectionate and loving. Nothing bad happened to Charlotte, and I was amazed. I did not understand. At first, I was quite afraid. Oh. I feared that she wanted to hurt me. I was constantly expecting the moment when Mum would abandon her. Because I did not deserve to live. I did not deserve to be loved. Nice nail polish. Am I going to hold this doll throughout it's the whole- It's cold. It's dark. Now she's cold. She'll get ill. We can take care of her. It's not forbidden. Charlotte is a good girl. I'm sure she is. Chapter 2. Can you put the f doll away? <laughs> I can't look at it. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's just 
<laughs> Damn it. What's this? There's noises, man. What are those noises, man? I don't like this place, dude. I'm getting chills all over the place. Was that back there before? I'm just gonna take out one ear. Just can't stand that. He doesn't want to. Not Charlotte. Fuck me. Where do we? Thanks. That's greatly appreciated. Of. Oh shit! That's a puzzle. Can I get rid of this doll? Jesus. I'm not watching that again. Um. Fuck it. I feel claustrophobic in this massive place, ironically. Oh, I was already here. Damn it. Damn it. This game. Game and a half. Let me think. You don't want to go down here, do you? Charlotte is cold. Let's find her a warm place. Whatever you say. It's three o'clock. What time is it now? I'm only 20 minutes ahead of time. Let's find her somewhere warm. We could go to the playground, if you want. <laughs> oh fuck, what? Fuck that. <laughs> Let's uh, go to the garden. Let's try that again. Um, here. Oh, it was locked. Yeah, that's right. Damn it! I'm getting real sick and tired of that doll's fucking face. He doesn't want to. No, in the town of light, he doesn't want to. He. He. Where? I'm gonna go down to the playground. It's warm in the sun, that's true. It'll turn cold in the evening. That's not good for Charlotte. No, it isn't, is it? So, we could go down to the greenhouses. If you want. I'm good whatever you want to do, and all things considered. I saw a wheelchair on the ground floor. It's a convenient place and we can get Charlotte into a warm place. Thanks, Kim. Okay. Wheelchair. Looking for a wheelchair on the ground floor, did you say that? You did say ground floor, right? Wheelchair on the ground floor, yeah. I don't remember seeing one, fuck's sake. Oh, wheelchair, okay. Oh, for fuck. This is a comfortable place for Charlotte. But it's cold. No, no. It's cold. Don't shiver, Charlotte. The cold will go away. Oh, fuck. What I'm picturing now is this doll coming up from behind the chair. It's gonna scare the absolute. We need to find warm lights. Let's go into the surgical ward. Go fudge your mother. Jokes don't do that. That's a bad thing to do. Surgical ward. Give me a second, Let's Charlotte. Take Charlotte into the surgical ward. There are warm lights there. Oh, I need to use the lift. It's on the second floor. Give me a second, Charlotte. Fuck Charlotte, damn it. <laughs> Fuck's sake, Charlotte. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm good at this. I can take care of a doll. There's no problem there.
Is it good, Charlotte? Is it good, Charlotte? Is it good, Charlotte? What's the time out? Alright. Let's go, Charlotte. Oh, for fuck, dicks. Oh, dicks. Right. Oh. Backing up. Backing up. Backing up. Backing up. Surgical ward. Surgical, surgical, surgical. Surgery is number seven. All the way down there. Dicks. God, this is eerie as all dicks, man. Hey, what? Can't get through there, dude. God, can I open? He doesn't want to. No, in the town of light, he doesn't want to. Dicks. Surgery, right? Radiology. Radiology. Surgery? Sure, yeah, that's close enough. Like the I wanted a game that was all very pretty and puzzly. Not a game that you're walking through an abandoned psychiatric institution with a doll named Charlotte. Dex. The cold goes away, you see? The light. Warm. We can do it. The cold goes away. It's not forbidden. Now we can go to that ward where everything started. Okay. I have not stopped getting chills. I swear to Christ. Observation award on the ground floor. Observation award number eight. Oh, it's on down here. Oh. This game better not be long. Ah. Uh. What the dick? What? 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 Hey, there's a dog outside. That's nice. I'm gonna look at the dog outside and not the game because the game scares me at the minute and there's nothing you can do that can stop me from doing that. Got this. I have water I can drink. Keep me calm. I'm gonna spill it over me if there's a... Ah! I'm sorry, what? Oh, dicks. Dicks, 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 dicks. This is not cool. This field of view is disgusting. God damn it. Can I sprint at all? What is... Uh, hey, what? Oh, okay. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Those are beds. It's very stunning. Very beautiful game. But god damn it. I did not really want to hard One day I turned off the light, but it didn't go dark. It was a limitless immensity, a blinding merciless light. I was 16 and I was afraid, always afraid, a fear that wore me down. I needed help, but I could not speak. Everything terrified me, even thinking. You know what's really funny? I'm wearing a cap that says no fear. They said they were taking me to a place where the fear would go away. Where I would get better. This was in the trailer. living in there. They dragged me away and tore off all of my clothes. 
every last stitch. I tried to explain what was going on in my head. They tied me to the bed for days. Alone with my nightmares. It wasn't fear anymore. It was madness. And when you're mad, you cease to exist. Hmm. Who's out at the foot of the bed, staring at me? This game does have some very interesting storytelling mechanics, and there's some stuff I can't actually keep in here. Or can I? She was my only hope in this hell. Hey. I was falling down amongst the damned. But that woman and her smile kept me alive. Is this good for YouTube? I might have to put an age restriction. Mm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's dark outside. Yeah, that's definitely dark outside, but the. The door is locked from the outside. Here, the doors can only be locked and unlocked from the outside. I'm sorry if I become very silent at times. You can't get out of here. Only the dead can leave. Now, then you say things like that, which does not help my situation, damn it. Nurses room one. Okay, at least that. Shut up! Damn it! <laughs> Scared. Oh God. Oh. Some people. Eh. <clears throat> okay. Hey, that guy has my shirt. At. Give me back my Charlotte. <laughs> All right, this game's intense and it has some very interesting storytelling mechanics. I have to say. How did he get down there so fast? I hit that. I can't stand that. I'm gonna ignore the fact that the thing just stopped automatically. Please forgive me. Syncing up. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That happens sometimes. Where am I? Okay. Okay. It laughed, panted, latched over me. It hurt when he touched me. Oh. I thought I'd split apart suddenly with a loud thud, shattered into pieces. I felt fragile, sick, dirty, filthy. All I could do was clutch Charlotte tightly while he... Rene obeyed. He was the boss in the realm of light. I was devoured by the evil I had done. I threw up and could feel hell getting closer and closer. My god. Those medical examinations. The doctors said there was something inside me. 
which they would have dragged out of me. Oh, my God. She was pregnant. Oh, that very cheerful music is the end of this episode. Oh my God, this game. <sighs> All right. I'm sorry if any of that did disturb you. I will put an age restriction on this because that's that's over the line. <laughs> um, yeah, that is definitely something that I didn't expect from this game. I have to say, um, this thing definitely has some very promising storytelling stuff ahead. So I will keep on playing, but I did not expect a horror genre. So I'm gonna have to be careful there because I don't really like playing horror by myself, especially with headphones. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so I'm gonna. I better see about I'm actually. But yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you liked it, please hit that like button. Because that's what you do when you like videos. Obviously. Um, if you guys want to see more of this, please comment below your thoughts on the game. If you want to see more at all. Because, you know, if you guys aren't comfortable with this game, I may stop. I'll play it along the side, but I won't film it. But, you know, that's just me. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next part. Cheers. Bye.